So we are now back in Chiang Mai. We had a 22 hour journey yesterday from Bang Dieng to Chiang Mai, all on like mini buses and buses. So it wasn't that great, we were both really tired. But we're back in Chiang Mai for the Lantern Festival for Yi Peng and we're gonna do that in the next couple of days. But we still need to do like the Elephant Sanctuary, um, which is a really humane one. It's like a rescue center for elephants. So we're going to do that and maybe go to the Grand Canyon again because that was really fun. But for tonight, we're going to go and have some sushi because Dan was really craving some sushi and like wouldn't shut up about it. So now we're going to get sushi from a place that's half an hour away. So we're at the cinema. So this is our little setup. How much does the ticket cost? Like eight quid for both of us? <laughs> Four pounds each yeah. or something. Yeah. Not too shabby. Even the popcorn's cheap. It was like four quid for large popcorn and two large drinks. So if you're in Thailand, good way to chill out is to go to the cinema. It's really early in the morning. We're going to see the elephants today at the Elephant Sanctuary. Um, I'll tell you a bit more about it later, but. So we're like halfway through, or like, yeah, about halfway through our elephant experience. How good is it? Incredible. It's, it's been actually the most been incredible one of the best of days of our lives. Yeah. Like, it, they are, they are so huge, but they're so like gentle and playful. We've, and we've swam with them. Yeah. We've like fed them. We've like. Uh, I think we're gonna go in the mud with them later. Unbelievable. The baby wants to Dumbo, and then there's like 
how many is there all together? Six? Five? There's two girls, two boys, and a baby. It was only like 1,600 baht, which is, how much is that? 32 quid. 32 quid each to do this for half a day. I would have paid like 100. And like, uh, you know, like obviously if this was a thing in, in like America, then you wouldn't be able to take your GoPro. No. They'd make you. Charge for the GoPro. They'd charge you for using your GoPro, and then charge you for all the photos here. Like they, we've had the GoPro, and we've also had all like, all photos taken by them with a DLSR. Yeah. They're putting them on Facebook for Yeah, them. and all our food is included, and transport was all included, like literally, it's so oh, cheap, it's so good. So good. I can't believe how well they're treated here as well, because obviously, like, I don't know if you can see, but this is like... Zoom in. Yeah, I'll zoom, zoom in. in. So this is where we're just chilling. The river we were just in is down there. And then they get, like, all of this space. But it goes straight to, to the so Oh, yeah, it goes down. so far. But they're all over there. They're being fed by some other people at the moment. They get, like, a whole crate of fruit every day. It's amazing. And there's, like, no chains, no... No, there's Riding. no like, beating. They're, just... they're not allowed. We're not allowed to ride them. Which put, is put it this way: from what we've seen, like if we were elephants, we'd live here, wouldn't we? Yeah. All they all they do is they oh, just yeah. get fed, bathed, and scrubbed by people. Yeah, <laughs> like they have the best life. You can just tell that they're happy. It's really cool. I'm so glad we came back to Chiang Mai I'm, now. <laughs> I travel all the way here just to do that again. Yeah, and we've got the lantern festival in a couple of days. It's going to be a good week, I think. Good evening, everybody. So today is actually a special occasion because. It's mine and Dan's two year anniversary since our first date. So that's fun. And I've actually got my face on and a little outfit for the occasion. We're gonna head off now to a restaurant called The Dukes in Maya Shopping Centre in Chiang Mai. In Chiang Mai. I'm very excited because we haven't eaten all day. We've had a half a croissant each because it was free. <laughs> okay, so we're out for dinner. Our food's just arrived. This is like a flashback to America. This is the pizza. We've still got a calzone and sliders. <laughs> Thank you very much. This is what we do every time we come out. Order way too much food. This is like the biggest pizza I've ever had. What's wrong with us? Why do we do this every time? Let's get a large, they said. It'll be fun, they said. They've got fridge in the hospital as well. Oh yeah, we can have it for breakfast tomorrow. But seriously. Someone needs my fucking food tomorrow. <laughs> We can't have a repeat of Houston. We've also got a calzone coming. <laughs> and sliders. And sl oh god. And they've we've just got, had ribs. <laughs> they've got a camera right outside the fridge, so if anyone eats that pizza, oh. I am going to lose it. Yeah, I know. I know you will. Right. So. <laughs> we've ordered too much. Yep, yeah, again. Right. We've got a 16 inch, I found out it's a 16 inch pizza by the way. 16 inch large pizza. A calzone, which is about the size of my head. Two of three of them. There was three of these burgers. We didn't know it came with chips, but it does. Between the two of us. <laughs> We're going to get all of this boxed up and just eat these, I think. And now these have arrived. We didn't even order these. <laughs> these came with the sliders. They came with the sliders. Right, okay. So this is what our table's looking like at the moment. There's something wrong with us. We need someone else, a third person in our relationship to just be like, no, no. You only need no more food. <laughs> Hey yo bro, we're about to start, man. Get to the mic. 